finally working here. Me too. How are you doing? Today is Tom's first day here at Lemonade Incorporated. I, I can't say that I'm pleased. At all. When I formed this company, I had a plan to only hire friends and family. Unfortunately, I didn't really have any friends. So I had to hire people I knew from high school that I wanted to be friends with. Now that Thomas Murphy is going to be working here, I'm going to have to compete with him for their love and friendship. Ooh, how are you? I'm really great, actually. This job is wonderful. I think you're going to have a great time. How long have you been working here? Um, Thomas! Hey, it's nice to see you hey, again. How are you? <laughs> I'm pretty sure you don't really remember me from high school. In fact, uh, if I remember correctly, I was the one who helped you pass pre-cal junior year. Mm, actually, I was the captain of the mathletes, and I'm pretty sure I was the one that tutored you junior year. Let me show you to your desk. All right. That's what you have to say, actually. You know, right? Yes. <laughs> Hi, Inez. How are you doing? Good. And this is Kyle, the famous brother. How are you doing? So how are you working, Inez? Uh, for a couple of weeks. Really? Do you like it? Here you go, Thomas. Uh, your brand new desk. Enjoy. Um, why is it facing the wall? Because... I didn't want you to be distracted by all the business stuff that goes on here. Okay, that's all right. I'll just put up some pictures of my fiance. <laughs> no, 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 no. You don't understand. My mother would kill me if anything is put on her walls. I won't make that mistake again. Okay, so now I need to formulate a plan to get rid of Thomas. Luckily for me, I'm a quick thinker. Hey, gorgeous. How's it hanging? You know it's more powerful than two sticks of dynamite? Why do you always ask me that? I'm not going to say what you want me to say. What, what are you talking about? I'm just being friendly. Sheesh, come on. Guy, I mean Gee, is a very important part of this office. He is our marketing expert. He's got it all. Brains, good looks, and charisma. Let's go. Let's go. Guy, we've talked about this. When I first met him, he was at a coffee shop talking to a girl for two hours. And of course, I, I later found out that the girl was listening to her iPod the whole time. But still, he was sitting at the same table as her for two whole hours. That's uh, pretty impressive. I don't mean to brag or anything, but I'm pretty sure I'm a genius. I mean, it's not like I've been tested or anything, but I'm pretty sure that when I am, people are going to be like, Holy crap, this kid's a genius! I mean, the best part is that all throughout college, I had a solid 2.5, and I didn't even study. So what are you doing here today? I thought you only came on Tuesdays and Fridays. I do, but today I have a special presentation for you guys. Yeah, nice. Yeah. So what's Jeanette's deal anyway? Is she always this cold to guys flirting with her? Well, what do you mean? I mean, what does it take for a guy like me to get with a girl like that? Dude, that's my girlfriend you're talking about. Uh, I thought the two of you broke up. Well, we did. But I got a plan to get her back. Oh, okay. A really good one. Please take me back. Please, please, please. I'm sorry, Kyle. It's over. I've moved on to bigger and better things. Bigger and better things? You're, you're a receptionist in my brother's home office. You never see things for what they are or what they could be. You're such a freaking pessimist. Yeah, I convinced my brother to hire Jeanette. Yeah, I mean, she was looking for a job, and I was looking to get her back. I mean, I had to promise her that I wouldn't tell anybody we had dated, and I had to promise my brother that I'd show up to work on time. Or at all. I know this is a small company, but even the big businesses started out small, didn't they? Right now, I'm looking to start my life over, a new beginning. Being a receptionist at Lemonade Incorporated is just one tiny leap into my new life. So what do you think I should do about Kyle? 
I mean, I still care for him, but I need to move on with my life. Don't worry about Kyle. He'll find someone else. I know he still loves you, but he'll learn to move on. Do you ever find it difficult to be a single woman at work? Of course. That's all part of the game. There's love, and then there's work. And sometimes the two can coexist. Just be patient. Everything will work out in the end. There they are, my two favorite girls. I have to go food shopping, Nathaniel. Do you want something from the store? I put a list in your purse. Great. Enjoy the rest of your day, all. Bye, Ma. Imagine yourselves walking in a hot, juicy meadow. The hot sun is pouring down on you. Sweat is oozing out of your pores. And perhaps for some of you, you decide to take off your shirts. Now you're all hot and sweaty and shirtless and bothered and thirsty. And you decide, I need a drink. And what better to quench your thirst than our brand new Citrusade. Ah, there's orange, grapefruit, lemon lime, tangerine, and my personal favorite, cranberry. What do you think, huh? I don't think you understand something here, Gee. This is Lemonade Incorporated. Not Orange Incorporated, not Grapefruit Incorporated. Lemonade Incorporated. I don't see what the big deal is. It's just a name. I mean, why can't we sell more than just lemonade? No, no, no! When I formed this company, I made a promise to myself that I would not sell anything else other than lemonade. That was three months ago. Still, a promise is a promise, and I am not about to let myself down. This is my company, and I decide what we sell and what we don't. Then why did you hire me as your marketing consultant? Because you have a degree in marketing. Your job is to help me expand this company, not take it over with your crazy radical right, ideas. Right, right, right. This was not the kind of distraction I was expecting today. And I still haven't figured out a way to get rid of Thomas. Maybe. Maybe I can accuse him of hitting on my mother. Which reminds me, I finally looked up what a MILF is, and I have to say, to all those guys out there, you are disgusting, and you have filthy, filthy minds. Uh, just a second. Yeah, so I told the guy, like, get out of here. What are you doing? Like, it's ridiculous. <laughs> hey, guys, what's so funny? Nothing, we were just talking. <laughs> really, just uh, talking. Yeah. So, Thomas, how was your first day here? It's going really well, thank you. Mm -hmm. Good, good. Okay, I was just on the web, and I found this really amazing job. What kind of job? Apparently, there's a company, and it's looking for an exciting, ambitious new HR rep. I'd uh, hate to hold you back in a dump like this, but if you want, I will write you a really good recommendation. No, actually, I really like it here. It's close by, I'm working with all my friends from high school. It's great, I couldn't be happier. Really, uh, I think you're underestimating how happier you'd be working somewhere else. No, I'm actually fine right where I am. Yeah, so, like, I was just telling this guy, like, what are you, what are you doing? Like, how can you park right there? Yeah, so I just got hired at Lemonade Incorporated. Uh, it's a really great company. Uh, I'm working with a lot of great people, uh, many of them whom I went to high school with. It's really great. And uh, I'm just really excited. You know, for a long time I was unemployed, but now I'm working with this company. It's brand new, fresh on the market, uh, just like the lemons we squeeze. So apparently none of my ideas work. Thomas is here to stay, at least for now.
Guess I'm just gonna have to find another way to make him leave. Take care, Jake. Thanks. Right, see you see tomorrow. You it, uh, have a good one. <sighs> uh, hey, um, do you want me to walk you to your car? <laughs> Thank you. Well, I'm not sure. I'm. I wouldn't want anything to happen to you while you were going out there. I think I can make it to my car, all right. <laughs> okay, well, how about a drink? Later. Just, you know, you and me, my treat. I don't think so, Kyle. I'm a bit tired. I think I'm just going to go home and veg for a while. Okay. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. I'll be here. I'll get her back. I don't know how, but I'll get her back.